Okay, so if you have watched my videos, you know I kind of sound like a robot, sort of. I don't know. And if I don't talk, there's no noise. There's no noise. There's no background noise. And if I did not have this program, then you would hear my fan of my computer spinning loud, loud, and clear. Um, so basically this program just gets rid of all of the uh, all of the uh, background noise uh it's kind of like the nvidia whatever noise thing they have i don't know i don't uh i don't really use nvidia cards and i yeah but basically uh noise torch is a program uh it's an easy and easy to use an open source application for Linux with pipe wire or a pulse audio case of virtual microphone that suppresses noise in any application. Uh, so yeah, uh, you can just put insert a uh, your microphone or whatever you use for sound into it and it gets rid of pretty much every uh, every like background sound. It's not perfect by any means like if I'm Typing while doing that, you can hear it, but who cares? It's just typing noises. The reason why I don't want to use my microphone just without a uh, noise torch is because you would hear my fan going berserk like a jet engine. And it's really, it's really helpful if you have like, let's say, I don't know, um, a fan in your room and you just don't want your microphone to pick that up. So noise torch is pretty easy. Um, on uh, Arch Pluto Pacman Dash S noise torch, I don't think they have a. Yeah, they don't have a uh, community package yet, but um. Uh, they do have a. It in the AUR. My AUR is uh broken at the moment. I'm gonna fix this tomorrow. Uh, it's cause I downloaded this weird package. For a mouse um uh hold on it sort of looks like this hold on let me, let me pull this up let me pull this up i was trying to get a where is it Bivata, rainbow okay whatever it's basically just a bunch of extra cursors that don't really and they don't really work in my system i don't know how but I tried to get it getting that uh fixed but whatever and it broke the aur for me and even if i use uh even if i use yay it's the same same thing if i try to update or anything here that's not the point though um that's my fault for not doing that whatever um and that's like the first time the ar has ever broken for me but the point is this is noise torch it's a small little program uh i well you can't see my mouse now huh you can only see this okay but basically I only have it at 10 because I still want you to hear my voice and I still like don't really care if I don't really want to sound like I'm cutting off every five seconds. Um, but yeah, uh, settings, uh, they don't really have much settings. I keep it at 10% because I don't really want uh, a lot of, you know, uh, like choppiness and because the voice detection. It's not perfect, but it does work for what I need it to use. Um, why is my Wi-Fi? Wait, what? See how that? That's that's weird. Um, I can you can see my mouse up there. Anyways, that's a that's because I was messing around with my mouse in the settings. I can see it on my screen, just not OBS isn't picturing uh capturing it. Anyways, so noise search is really great. You could set this all the way up, and then it will only hear like like definite voice sounds. I don't really know how this works. I'm not a developer. You select your microphone. This is the microphone I got. It's a cheap um, Amazon one and it works. Uh, so yeah, I just want to make this quick video. It's great for noise suppression. If you have a fan or a dog or I don't know if dogs will really work, but it, it works really great. It, it's like a, like I said before, it's like a NVIDIA voice. I think that's a thing. Um, yeah, I don't really use an NVIDIA card. It works really great. Um, let's try to do this, but I don't know if you'll be able to hear me, uh, reload. 
All right, so um, this is editor Carson here, and I just want to let you guys know uh, the audio for this section of the video got sort of messed up. It's a pulse audio issue, and the fact that I'm switching my noise torch from on to off, and you know, I'm just I just toggled noise torch, and I was playing with the settings. So if you can bear through that, that's fine. Um, if not, I have the timestamp timestamp on it right now, uh, so you can skip through that. Um. And, uh, yeah, thanks for sticking in there. Hello? Okay, now I probably... S I can't hear myself, but now I probably sound a lot more, like, robotic. Um, but if I do, do other things. Like, I'm going to bang on my uh, desk a little bit. Yeah, you couldn't hear that, and I was banging on the desk. That's right below the microphone. Now, hold on, hold on, hold on. I'll put my microphone down, and then bang on my desk. Yeah, you literally can't hear that. But then if I'm talking, you can hear that I am banging on my desk. I don't know. But it's it's really great. Um but no, I can't do that. Um cool. But usually I keep it at ten. Uh let me reload it real quick. Okay, so yeah, usually I keep it at ten because you know I don't really have much background noise except for my loud ass fan in my room. I'm going to keep this at zero and I'll let you know the difference. Okay. Uh, now it's picking up me going on. And you can hear, you can probably hear this. Um, no, you can't. Um, it's still working. It's still picking up the fan uh anyways if i switch it back to just a raw microphone in obs or discord or whatever i'm using at the time uh then you'll be able to hear my fan and that's that's the whole point if you have any uh like background noise that you can't really get rid of easily then install noise torch it's pretty easy to install i don't know about other distros i'll put the github link in the description and uh yeah install it use it and it works um but the one thing is it doesn't you have to press launch noise torch on every startup so just have noise torch startup when uh you start your computer uh i have it in my dot nx rc i have it right here noise torch so basically what it does is oh you probably can't see this so yeah, just I have noise torch launch when I start my computer and yeah, it, it works great. I love it. I love this application because my fans are annoying. Um, but yeah, that's another point. Uh, just have it start whenever you uh, launch into your uh, X session and you have to press launch noise torch for it to work and then just set it as your default uh, microphone and whatever. Um, audio interface you use um input whatever and and uh, this is called pulse mixer um pretty cool simple that's 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 the point so set it as your default one and uh, uh your settings if you, you'll probably know how to do that look up whatever your desktop environment or window manager you use and you'll find a way anyways uh how is this video a long i'm literally just rambling about a application anyways if you're still here like the video because I don't know where you're still here. Uh, donate to me on OnlyFans because you should. Um, and yeah, I don't even have OnlyFans. Bye.